twice this time. Uh, yeah. I want to see you. Oh, right, for the last drops. So no, no, it's only not out of the same. You want me to pin the drops? Yeah. 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 Awesome being able to record some stuff in, in Capitol Studios. You know, obviously it's very historic and very rich in history. Cylindrical this building is. Iconic. I feel like we feel like a little bit amateur. Yeah, know, I definitely feel like we've yeah. uh, just tainted Capitol yeah. Studios. <laughs> well especially when you get to see the, the diamond record of Please Hammer Don't Hurt <laughs> MC Hammer's diamond record yeah. and us don't belong in the same building. It's the black fly in the Chardonnay, so to speak. <laughs> Trying to get the arrangements and instrumentations and uh, everything, harmonies and whatnot, uh, ready for, for today's little acoustic recording that we did was, was actually fairly challenging. It was, uh, we had two days to uh, kind of try and get things together and it was a little bit stressful, but um, I think we, well hopefully we pulled it off, I, we'll, uh, we'll find out here. <laughs> you may but, have. Um, <laughs> But uh, yeah, I mean, it was... <laughs> <laughs>
consequences God don't make me face up to this And I so hate consequences And running from you is on my best defenses Cause I know that I let you down And I don't wanna deal with that And I spent all last night tearing down Every stoplight and stop sign in this town Now I think there might be a way to stop me now Get away despite the fact I'm so way down Oh, the fact I'm so way down The album title Five Score and Seven Years Ago came from, um, there's five of us, this is the first time we've done an album with five of us, um, and I kind of had this whole like idea of just kind of having a five theme because it's our fifth record as well. Um, our first record came out seven years ago, and then the whole, you know, Four Score and Seven Years Ago, and the, that whole thing, it just kind of happened, and uh, it's not, you know, uh, we don't... It's, it's, not not, it's not brilliant, it's just an it's idea. Not brilliant. You know? It's just an album title. But um, <laughs> at the same time, it, you know, it's cool that I, you know, it lines up with some of the things that are going on. Sunrise coming up over the Pacific end. You might think I'm losing my mind, but I will shy away from the specifics. Cause I don't want you to know where I am. Cause then you'll see my heart in the saddest day it's ever been. And this is no place to try and live my life stop right there that's exactly where i lost it see that line i never should have crossed it stop right there i never should have said that it's the very moment that i wish i could take back I'm sorry for the person i became i'm sorry that it took so long for me to change Ready to be sure I never become that way again. Cause who I am ain't too open. Who I am ain't too open. I talk to absolutely no one. Myself enough and the things bottled inside that finally begun to create so much pressure I'd soon blow up. And I heard the reverberating footsteps sinking up to the beating of my heart. And I was positive that unless I got myself together, I'd watch me fall apart. And I can't let that happen again. You'll see my heart in the saddest state it's ever been and This is no place to try and live my life Stop right there, that's exactly where I lost it See that line, I never should have crossed it Stop right there, I never should have said that It's the very moment that I wish I could take back I'm sorry for Person I became. I'm sorry that sorry it took that so long for me to change. I'm ready to ready be sure to I never become.
we try to be diverse. We try to do things that aren't uh, typically uh, our genre of band. What what they what they do. So um, you know the fact that we got to play, you know, Rhodes and, and a real <laughs> piano and, and uh, vibes and just little quirky yeah, and things. And I get to play shakers the whole time. Yeah, I mean it's like, <laughs> granted we're not like professional, you know, vibes players or anything, but it was it's really fun to I think you know branch out a little bit like that and just kind of play around. That's what music's all about, you know, like trying to stretch yourself. Uh, the first time I ever played banjo was two years ago whenever I joined this band. You know, it was kind of Matt's idea. Um, it's kind of incorporated itself into some more songs, so it's fun. I, I enjoy playing uh, different instruments. I, I, I'm kind of like a gear head. I like to mess around with gear. And it's funny to think of how much has changed, you know, since like, uh, you know, we were in high school just playing shows on the weekends here and there whenever we could. And, you know, there's a lot of really awesome things about you know, just having the opportunity to do this. behind and in the end you'll know I've lied to get your attention I'm faking my own suicide yeah I'm faking my own suicide because I know he loved me he just haven't realized I'm faking my own suicide the hold a double funeral Cause a part of you will die along with me I wish you thought that I was dead So rather than me You'd be depressed instead And before arriving at my grave You come to the conclusion Love me all your days, but it's too late, too late for you to say, because I'm faking my own suicide, because I know you love me, you just haven't realized, I'm faking my own suicide, the hold a double funeral, because a part of you will die alone. I'll write you a letter that you'll keep Reminding you your love for me Was more than six feet deep Say loud that you would have been my wife And right about that time Is when I come back to life And let you know I'd let you know That all along I was faking my own suicide Cause I know you loved me, you just never realized I was faking my own suicide You all walk in that room and see your eyes open so wide, open so wide Because you know, because you know you will never leave my side There's always, you know, outside influences, and, and yeah, it does often revolve around what's current and, and what, you know, is really uh, captivating us. Uh, we covered Sloop John B today. Uh, Brian Wilson's like a huge influence on what I do, and, and it's a completely different time, uh, you know, 
and music has changed so much. Like our musical tastes across the board are a huge range of differences and, and they're constantly expanding and the whole world of iPods and all that kind of stuff. It's just like you, we constantly are able to have music that we're listening to. So I think it's, it's getting more and more difficult to actually pinpoint influences uh, because we're all becoming more and more exposed to more and more music. And hopefully we we're able to, to take what we hear and kind of build and expand and just kind of uh, make it our own in a sense. You know, yeah. we're going to make music ourselves. One, two, three, four. Sloop John B. My grandfather and me. Around Nassau town, we do roam. Drinking all night. Got into a fight. Oh yeah. I feel so break up. I wanna go home. Here we go. What's up? John B. Sales See how the main sales sets Come for the captain ashore Let me go home I want to go home Why don't you let me go home Yeah I feel so break up I want to go home First plane he got process was a little peculiar for us on this album. Um, it was the first one where there was five of us, but it was also the first album where none of us live in the same city. Uh, and that just kind of happened. Um, you know, we lost a bass player, not, uh, he quit, and um, <laughs> not lost. <laughs> we, lost him. <laughs> we were traveling and he wandered off and <laughs> never found him again. But uh, so John, you know, replaced him. John's from Denver. Uh, we added another guitarist. Uh, John's from Nashville. And Matt moved to Nashville, so now I'm the only one left in Canton, Ohio, and Dave lives in Cleveland, Ohio, and getting together to write 
it, it wasn't a possibility really. So a lot of it, you know, I worked on the initial stages myself, did a, did a bunch of demos, and then we ended up getting together down in Nashville and then out here in Los Angeles and just really collaborated, and that's when the songs really started to take shape. told me the right way the right way to go about this so I'll figure it out for myself cause how much is too much to give you well I may never know so I'll just give until there's nothing I'll give, give, give Till there's nothing else Give away all Till it all runs out Give, give And I'll have no regrets I'll give until there's nothing left on No one told me how bad I need All by myself You see I want All you have to offer So I'll offer myself I'll just give until there's nothing else Devastation and reform is just basically stating the fact of life that we screw things up and then we try and repair them and, and a lot of times it, things get repaired for us um, and then we go and screw them up again and uh, you know wrote this song in, in the middle of the, the reparations and uh, you know basically just it, it frustrates me because I feel like uh, you know the second verse talks about just this whole like masochistic sort of I gotta I gotta hurt myself so I have a story to tell because there's got to be conflict and uh, then I gotta fix it all and then I gotta do it again so it's it's about the cycle and the frustration and all that Never go 
And here I sit, thinking of God knows what Afraid to admit I might self-destruct So lock the windows and bolt the door Cause I got enough problems without creating more I feel like I was born for devastation and reform Destroy everything I love and the worst part is my heart I reconstruct But in the end it's nothing but a shell of what I had when I first started Injury I'll cause with my own fist Seems to me to be slightly masochistic But there'd be no story Without all this dissension So I inflict the conflict With the utmost of intention So lock the windows And bolt the door Cause I got enough problems Without creating more Feel like I was born for devastation and reform. Destroy everything I love, and the worst part is, I pull my heart out, reconstruct. But in the end, it's nothing but a shell of what I had when I first started. fun it's been crazy uh hopefully you enjoyed it and uh hopefully um you guys keep liking our bands and we'll be able to like get you more stuff like this so take it easy Give until 